Hello. Good evening. Hello. Good evening. evening. Good evening. Hello. 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 Me escuchan? Hello. hello. Welcome. Hello. Hello. Hello, Pedro. Hello, Mayra. Hello, hello Noé. Hello, William. Hello, hello, Maria. Hello. Good evening. Hello, Ismael. Hello, Andrea. Hello, Maria Salome. William, welcome, welcome. How are you today? Wait, wait a second. How are you today? How was your day, everybody? Good evening, teacher. Good evening. How are you today? Activity. Oh, I'm fine. <laughs> okay, that's great. What happened? I didn't understand. What happened, William? I'm fine, teacher. Uh, many that's... activities at work. Oh, you have many activities at work. Oh my goodness! But we are half of the week. Ya hicimos dos días, verdad? So we are ya casi, ya casi jueves y viernes. Nothing. Okay. So it's like almost we are in the weekend. So don't worry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Um. So we can do this. Yo sé que podemos hacer esto. So let's try it. Okay. Let's continue doing our best. Vamos a continuar siendo, haciendo nuestro mayor esfuerzo en todas las actividades que tengamos, verdad? So let's go ahead and continue. And right now we are going to go with and start. Right. Vamos a continuar con inglés principiante módulo uno. Today it is Wednesday, May third, two thousand twenty-three, and we are going to continue uh, with. Uh, well, today we're going to finish with the colors because yesterday we didn't finish. Vamos a terminar con los colores, ¿verdad? And also we are going to continue with the clothes, right? Um, and then uh, we are going to continue with the, with the, oh my goodness, with the weather and seasons, okay? Y después vamos a continuar con los weathers and seasons. Aunque okay, aquí en El Salvador, Supposedly, we only have two. Supuestamente solo tenemos dos, but I feel that we have three, okay? Pero yo, yo siento que tenemos three. In some some part of the, the country, they have the four of them, okay? Y para mí, yo creo que algunas partes del de país tienen las cuatro estaciones, but mm, we didn't, we don't take it into account. Aquí, pues, no se toma muy en cuenta. So, let's see. So today we are going to continue with unit number four, that is I'm not wearing boots, okay? So, um, so right now we are going to go with, okay, uh, the agenda. This is the agenda that I will have for today, okay? And we are going to, let's see. Okay, so we were doing with the clothes, right? Ayer empezamos con algunos de ustedes. I remember it was... Dennis, and it was, oh, I don't remember who was the other one, that he was um, doing the description of the clothes, okay? Que estaba haciendo la descripción de la ropa que estaban utilizando, right? Uh, uh, oh, Noé, Noé, creo que tú fuiste el otro que describió, oh, William, I don't remember, ¿quién fue? Oh, no, no, no. No, no, okay, no. I don't, I don't remember. Okay, but volunteers to describe what you are wearing. Volunteers, can you describe what you are wearing today? Volunteers, okay, William, thank you very much. Okay, let's go, William. What are you wearing? Tell me, William. Good I'm... night, everyone. Good uh, night. I'm wearing t-shirt. Okay, a blue t. A bl what color is that teacher? Black. A black teacher. Uh huh. Black, what else? I'm a black teacher. Uh -huh. uh, a short dark blue. Okay. And sandals. Oh, great. And headphones. Okay. With the sandals, what color are the sandals, mister? Black. Black, Black sandals. sandals. Okay, perfect. Very good. Thank you, Mr. William. William, okay. can you tell me one letter, please, from, from the alphabet? Una letra de alphabet that you want to try? Mm. And... N, okay, let's go N. Vamos a ver quién tiene N. Noé, Noé, it's the one. <laughs> Noé, tell me, tell me, what are you wearing today? Tell me, tell me, describe yourself. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm wearing teacher gray. Okay. Uh, pants black. Okay. Uh, socks. Uh, uh, 
white. Okay. And bell, black. A bell, black. Exactly, mm -hmm. Mr. Thank you. Very good. Uh, so that was perfect. Now, when you are describing something to remind you, algo para recordarles, cuando estamos describiendo lo que estamos utilizando de ropa, primero, y queremos decir el color, primero decimos el color y después decimos el objeto. Like, for example, I am wearing a pink shirt, okay? Because this is my pink shirt, okay? Entonces, dice primero el color, a pink shirt because it's a shirt uh no it's a blouse basically this is a blouse okay so i am wearing a pink a pink blouse okay so this is primero color y después dice el objeto ya sea para cualquier cosa carro eh, like any object in the house cualquier objeto en la casa y en este caso pues la ropa okay let's go no eh no eh tell me one number from one to five no eh un número de no no un número ah, un número del uno al cinco no don't worry don't worry uh -huh. okay, uh, four four okay so let's go one two three four Ismael Ismael are you ready yes teacher repeat again please can you describe what you are wearing podría describir lo que estás utilizando de ropa I... I am using. I am wearing. Uh huh. I'm wearing the shirt. Uh huh. And t-shirt. Uh mm huh. -hmm. And socks. And socks. Very good. What color are the socks? Uh, color black. Ah, black. Black socks. Yes. Excellent. Very good. Thank you, Ismael. Ismael, tell me one number from one to five. Guillermo. No. <laughs> Guillermo, okay, Guillermo, está Guillermo. Guillermo, tell me, Guillermo. What are you wearing? I am wearing a orange t-shirt. Okay. And a white shirt. Okay. And, and a two rings. Two rings. Okay, what about the, yes. the food? Are you wearing something? Or barefoot, barefoot a descalzo. Yes. Barefoot, okay, barefoot descalzo. Okay, that's great. Thank you very much for sharing, Guillermo. Guillermo, can you tell me one number from one to five, please? From one to five, del uno al cinco, tell me, Guillermo. One. One, okay, Mayra. <laughs> Mayra, you're number one right now in the picture right here. So okay. tell me, tell me what are you wearing? Okay, I'm um, wearing a light green t-shirt, um, a black short, and um, blue crocs. Blue crocs, excellent. Very good. Thank you for sharing. Thank you. Mayra, can you tell me one letter from the alphabet, please? A. A, a, a letter A, okay. A, so it will yes. be Andrea <laughs> or Antonio. Okay, but let's go with Andrea and then Antonio. Okay, let's go. Okay. Okay. I'm wearing a pink dress. Okay. Ah, okay. Nice. Uh -huh. Wow. She was prepared. She was prepared. <laughs> okay. I'm wearing a pink dress. Okay. Earrings. Yeah. Uh -huh. Very good. Um, rings. A ring. Ring. Uh -huh. Rings. Ring. Uh -huh. okay. Do you, you In the foot. In the foot. What do you have? Do you have like uh, flip flops or barefoot? Barefoot. Barefoot. Oh my goodness. Everybody barefoot. No chanclas. No chanclas in the house. <laughs> That's okay. That's perfect. Thank you, Miss Andrea. Andrea, tell me one number from one to five. Um, one. One. Okay. So we'll be Antonio. Antonio, you're the next one. Tell me. Tell me. I am well teacher. I'm short. Uh huh. Relax. Glasses? Um, glasses? Glasses. Glasses. Shirt. A t-shirt. A t-shirt. Porque shirt. la shirt es la que tiene botoncitos, ¿ok? Yes. Ok. A shirt. Mm -hmm. Grace. Uh, what, sorry? 
A chair, Grace. Okay, a uh, chair. Sure. Grace. Gray, gray maybe? Oh, gray. <clears throat> okay, a uh, gray shirt, you say, right? Short sure, black. Short sure, black. Ah, okay, black short. Remember the yeah. first is the color. Yeah. Okay, black shirt. Primero dices black el shirt. color y después dices el objeto. Okay, so that's okay. okay. Yeah. And do you have flip flops, sandals, cracks, shoes? <laughs> yes, sandals. Ah, okay. Very good. What color? What color are the sandals? Uh, eh, purple. Purple. Oh, no. <laughs> it's very good. We said thank you. Okay, let's go. Antonio, Antonio, tell me one number from one to five. Let's go with the last uh, one. Seven. Seven. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Walter. Walter, what are you wearing? I'm uh, wearing a red shirt. Uh -huh. uh, wearing blue pants and my brown shoes. Uh, uh, your what? Sorry? Shoes. Uh, shoes, shoes, sorry. Uh -huh, the shoes. brown shoes. Oh, nice. Thank you, Walter. That's good. Uh, I don't know if I have another volunteer. I don't know, Maria Solomé, Joel, Daniela, or Marvin, Jonathan. Did, oh, no, Jonathan, it was the one that described yesterday. Yo creo que John, okay, Jonathan, tell me, Jonathan. I'm sorry. Oh, I'm wearing uh, a yellow t-shirt, mm -hmm. uh, black pants, mm -hmm. and black flip flops. Exactly. Thank you, Mister, for sharing. Very good. You don't have any glasses, like bracelets or necklace or earrings, no? No, nothing. Okay. Okay. Very good. Thank you for sharing. Mr. Jonathan, let's go, Maria Salome. Can you tell us, Maria Salome, what are you wearing today? I'm wearing a beige suit. Okay. Uh, black and white blouse. Uh huh. And blue jeans. Blue jeans. And what about the food? Are you wearing sandals, flip flops, shoes? Beige shoes. Beige shoes. Shoes. Only shoes. Okay. Yeah, perfect. Excellent. Thank you for sharing and thank you for giving your description. Let's go, Joel. Tell me, Joel, what are you wearing today? I am wearing blue and teal. Uh huh. And orange short. Black shoes. Okay. I'm sorry. Large. What do you say? Uh, orange short. Orange short, uh huh, and the shoes uh, or no shoes? Uh, black shoes. Black shoes, okay, that's good, that's good. Thank you, Mr. for sharing. Very good, very good. Okay, now let's go, and we are going to continue because we have something else, okay, in here. The next practice that I have for you is this one. It says complete the sharp with the words from part A. So, as you remember, uh, we have this yesterday. And then uh, what I what we are going to do right now is that we have to complete which one is warm weather for one weather. ¿Cuál, creo que, eh, ¿Cuál creen ustedes que sería para la, el, el clima agra, bueno, caliente y cuál sería para el cold weather? Can you mention some of them? Eh, weather. Uh, una t-shirt. I'm sorry. Uh -huh. Anything else? <laughs> yes, we do sure. want. We want. <laughs> yeah, we want coffee. Uh huh. So what else? <laughs> what else for warm weather? Uh, in, in a warm weather, uh, a hat. Uh huh. In shorts. Shorts. A very Sh good. Shirt. Sandals, hat. Uh huh. What else? Sunglasses. Okay. What else? Cup. Maybe t-shirt. Okay. Teacher. Uh huh. And what else? Dress. Dress. Okay. Exactly. What else? Mm. Swimsuits. 
Okay, swimsuit. Uh huh. Short, what else? Short. Uh huh. Short. Sandals. Uh -huh. Here. Uh huh. Here. A skirt. Uh huh. Very good. Excellent. Okay. What about cold weather? What can you say for cold weather that you can use? Car. Sweater. Okay. Sweater. Uh huh. What else? Scar. Scarf. Okay. Scarf. Uh huh. Coat. Uh, coat. Uh, coat. Uh, coat. Remember, coat. No. Coat. Uh huh. Pants. I'm sorry. In pants, jacket, socks, gloves, socks, uh huh, gloves, boots, ah, uh, yeah, for the for the cold weather, right? Very good. Suit, uh -huh. sneakers, suit, uh huh, sneakers, excellent. Yes. No shoes. Excellent. Raincoat. Raincoat. Excellent. Okay, let's see what do we have here. Okay, we have different uh, ones. Okay, can you help me, Miss Daniela, to read the ones that are in cold, I mean, hot weather, please? Can you help me to read? Miss Daniela, are you there? Uh, I don't know what happened to Miss Daniela, but she's there. Okay, what about you? Please help me. I want the ones that haven't participated. Marvin, Marvin, can you help me to read, please? Warm weather? Marvin? Nothing? What? Jonathan? Help me. Okay, shirt. Sure. Blows, tie, skirt, belt, pants, high heels, dress, cap, t-shirt, shorts, socks, sneakers, and swimsuits. Exactly. Thank you, Mister. Let's go with uh, cold weather. In cold weather, can you help me, please, Dennis? Okay. Um, Raycon. Uh-huh. Raycon. Head. Twitter, blows, boots, coat, jeans. Exactly. Sweater. Remember, sweater. Sweater. Mm -hmm. Very good. Okay, so that was perfect. Do we have any questions so far? Questions? Or we are good. Okay. Let's, no. okay, so I think we're good with that. But before we go with the seasons, okay, we are going to do attendance section, okay? In the attend, what happened to my camera? I thought it was off, uh, on. Uh, so let's see. In the next one, what are we going to do? We are going to do attendance section, okay? Give me one second. Give me one second. I don't know what is happening with my camera. Okay, there, there. Okay, so where are you? Okay, there. Uh, I'm gonna do attendance section. Please activate your cameras. Okay, por favor, activa sus cámaras por favor, para poder hacer esa asistencia. Okay, give me one second because this thingy, oh no, here. Okay, so please say present. Okay, por favor, digan present. Andrea Marlene. Present. Thank you. Daniela Beatriz. Present. Lo okay. siento por no contestar anteriormente, pero se me trabó la compu y me acabo de conectar del cel. Oh, I'm sorry, Miss. Don't worry, don't worry. In the next one, you can participate, please. Okay, let's try it. En la próxima, tal vez puedes participar. Okay, Miss, thank you. Eh, Denis Alberto. Present. Thank you. Eric Alberto. Eric, no Eric today. Okay, wait. Guillermo Baltazar. Present. Thank you. Ismael Ernesto. 
Present. Thank you, Joel Gonzalez. Present. Thank you. Jonathan David. Present. Thank you. Luis Mario. Maria Salomé. Present. Thank you. Martin Rigoberto. Present. Eh, Mayra Alejandra. Present. Noé Danilo. Present. Thank you. Pedro Alexander. Pedro Antonio. Present. Walter Alexander. Present. Thank you. William Alexander. Present. Thank you. Yolanda Cristina. Okay, perfect. Thank you very much. Okay, let's go ahead and continue. Vamos a continuar. Uh, something that I want to remind you, algo que quería recordarles es que recuerden que para este viernes debemos de tener terminada la sección número 3 y también tienen el midterm, si no me equivoco, tenemos el ex, eh, un examen, sí, sí, tenemos un examen para este, para este, este viernes, o sea, ya sí, ya pues ya vamos avanzando diario, este, para el viernes podríamos realizar el examen, pero el examen siempre se hace obviamente cuando pues practican en la plataforma, no es que van a estar conmigo cuando hagan la, el examen, ok, el midterm es como digamos el, el examen de medio curso, yes, Mr. Guillermo, tell me, eh, pero esto no lo habíamos, nos habían dicho que era para la semana pasada, nos habían dicho que teníamos que terminar sí. eso. Yo sí. pensaba lo mismo que la semana pasada. Sí, eh, yo recibí un mensaje que me dijo, que me dijeron de que tenía que tenerlo ya listo para la semana pasada. ¿Really? Yes, it's true. Yes, oh. yes, ya está, teacher. Oh my goodness. Ok. Yo... So... En la sección 5 estoy ya casi terminándola. What? <laughs> that's awesome. Then. Okay, that's good. Entonces, bueno, I'm sorry if you already did it. Uh, but yeah, okay, supposedly we were, well, vamos a empezar esta ya. And, well, anyways. Sí, porque ya vamos por acá. What, what, bueno, no es what are you doing, but similar, the topic. But, okay, that's great. If you have any questions, remember that I will be happy to help you. Si tienen alguna duda, yo, pues yo pensé que era para esta semana. No sé por qué, pero yo pensé que era para esta semana. Es que la cosa está en que yo no chequeo la plataforma, sino que la chequeé a alguien más, pero pues yo les tengo que recordar, ¿verdad? Entonces, siempre. Entonces, este, pensé que iban por la, la section 3, pero sí, van de hecho ya para la otra semana, para el viernes igual, ya tienen que haber terminado todo, ¿verdad? No, yo creo que ya para el jueves, esta semana creo que ya tienen que haber terminado todo por lo de las notas, cuestión de notas y de certificados, vea, y diplomas que yes. le van a dar y así. Ajá. Este, si tienen alguna duda, cuando estén haciendo la plataforma, you can text me. Ya saben que me pueden escribir y yo con gusto les voy a apoyar. Ok. A veces me tardo un momentito, vea. I'm sorry. Pues, oh my goodness. <ríe> a veces me tardo un momentito ahí en contestarles, pero sí les voy a poder apoyar. Ok, ustedes me escriben. Eh, Saturday and Sunday, too. también el sábado y el domingo yo les puedo apoyar, ok, así que no worries, ok, uh, ok, so that's great, si sí, ya vamos terminando, perfect, perfecto for you, ok, si sí, van terminando, excelente, no worries, bueno, entonces let's continue. And so, as I, as I was telling you, we are going to continue with seasons. So we have uh, like four different seasons. Tenemos cuatro diferentes seasons, and here we have them, okay? Can you help me, please, to read the number one? Uh, let's go with Andrea. Can you read number one, please? Okay. Hmm? It's the spring in Brazil. Mm -hmm. It's raw. It's very sunny. Exactly. It's warm and it's very sunny. Thank you, Miss. Then we have here. Uh, next one. Can you help me to read, Antonio? It's a summer in Korea. It's raining. It's uh, hot and humid. 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 Yes. Exactly. Thank you. Let's go next one. Help me to read, please, Daniela. It's fall in the USA. It's cool. It's cloudy and 
Windy. 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 Windy, exactly. Very good. Thank you, Miss. And then we have here the last one. Help me to read, please. Joel. Miss Booker is Lucia. Is Suzy. Is very cold. Exactly. It's very cold. Thank you. Okay. Now, as you can see, we have seasons and we have some weathers too. Okay. Tenemos seasons y tenemos weather. Okay. Different. El seasons son las diferentes etapas del año, ¿verdad? Las diferentes estaciones. Okay. And then we have, we have four. Tenemos en el alrededor del mundo, tenemos cuatro. Eh, one is spring. The other one is summer. Fall or autumn, okay, and winter, okay. Tenemos estas que son las seasons, eh, spring, que sería eh, primavera, summer, verano, fall o, o autumn, que significa otoño, que es cuando las hojas se caen, y el winter, que es pues cuando llueve, vea, invierno, right? Um, so, each of these seasons, cada una de estas seasons tiene eh, weather, ok, tiene un diferente weather, un clima diferente, ok and uh, which ones are the weathers that you can identify from the pictures, cuáles son los weathers que pueden identificar de, de las imágenes warm, raining uh -huh. cool and snowing exactly, warm sunny rainy, cold. I'm sorry cold, Cold, exactly. Humid. Uh, here we have one, but I cannot see it. Cloudy. Uh -huh, cloudy. Exactly. Cloudy, windy. I'm sorry. Windy and and snowy. Okay. And so here we have these ones. Okay. Y aquí tenemos los diferentes los diferentes weather, ¿verdad? Tenemos warm, que significa como caliente. Aparte, este sería warm es caliente, pero no como hot, ¿verdad? Que hot es re caliente. <laughs> ¿Ok? Sunny, as, eh, sería soleado. And then we have rainy, que es eh, lluvioso. Hot, calientísimo, right? Like San Miguel is super hot. Cold, helado. Humid, húmedo. Cool, que es agradable. I'm sorry? Frío. Frío oh, es agradable. cold, cold. Ah, cold, cold. Uh -huh. Humid era húmedo, cool, agradable, cloudy, este sería eh, con muchas nubes, ok. Eh, and then we have windy, con mucho viento, y snowy, con mucho, mucha nieve, right? So, ok. So, in here in El Salvador, what seasons do we have? Aquí en El Salvador, ¿cuáles son las seasons que tenemos? Summer and winter. Summer. Only, only, sorry? Sunny. In winter. Exactly. We only have summer and winter. Solo tenemos las seasons de summer and winter. Pero para mí que existen las cuatro. Porque miren, después de que yes. viene, sí, que después de, de winter, que no, let's say that in December is summer. Okay, yo siento que en diciembre es summer. Después viene winter. Bueno, no, después viene fall. En December este winter. Es, really? Yeah, yes. No, it's not, but I, I, I don't know. But for me, it's like winter. Yeah, well, let's say winter. Después tenemos summer. Después tenemos, ahorita estamos en spring para mí, ¿verdad? porque todos los árboles están floreciendo, mucha fruta, ¿verdad? Y ya casi empezamos esto, fall. Ya se, bueno, ya empieza, ¿verdad? con esto de la lluvia, ya empieza a, a, a que se caigan las... Las, las hojitas, right? So, for me, it's all. Pero solo estamos registrados como summer and winter. And that's it. And then we have weather. How's the weather in San Salvador? Let me, I want to know. How's the weather in San Salvador right now? How much about weather today? Rainy. Rainy, really? Right now? What about, uh, de que otro lugar acá? Sam, Samuel, for example. Samuel here. It was hot. 
y estaba rainy like a little bit while ago. What about qué otros lugares tenemos por acá? Eh, ¿Qué es Altepeque? ¿Qué es Altepeque? ¿Somebody for qué es Altepeque? Drizzling. Drizzling. Oh, nice. Te estaba pringando. Ok, that's good, that's good. Eh, ¿Qué otros lugares? Tell me, tell me. Santa Ana. Ok, Santa Ana. Tell me, how was the weather in oh, Santa Ana? Pico. Ok, o oh, Pico, Santa Ana. Well, but first, Santa Ana. How was the weather? ¿Cómo estamos en uh, En rain cool. And rainy and cold. Mister, I want to be there because here in, in Samia, nothing, nothing cold. Hot. It's super hot. I don't like it. <laughs> Excellent. Thank you. Opico, how's Opico? Tell me the weather, Raining. mister. How? Raining. Raining? It's raining. Ra oh, my goodness. What about, ¿qué otros lugares uh, besides Opico? Santa Cruz de Colón. Ok, Lo Urtes, tell me. Uh -huh. <laughs> right now it's raining. Raining. And it's cool. It's cool, ok. It's like drizzling, like, like pringao, pringao, drizzling. Yes. Ok, drizzling. Yes. That's good, that's good. Drizzle, it's drizzling. Ok, uh, let's see, anybody else? Uh, you escuché a alguien que dijo algo por ahí? <laughs> Santa Tecla, okay, Santa Tecla. How's Santa Tecla right now? It's, here is raining, it's lightning, and lightning. it's cold. Yes. Oh my goodness, lightning. Be careful, mister, because we're in the computer. <laughs> Con esos trenos, esos yes, relapos, be, be careful, be careful. I don't want you to die. <laughs> yes, be careful. Okay, great. Sonsonate. Sonsonate. Tell me, mister, how is Sonsonate? Uh, rainy. Rainy. Ah, oh, that's good. So I think all the Salvador is rainy. Creo que en todo Salvador está lloviendo then because, bueno, aquí ya no, ya está seco, ya nothing. <laughs> nothing. <laughs> it's like, like this. And it was like diluvio in the, in the afternoon. And right now, nothing. Ya no, no queda nada ahí de, de prueba que llovió. <laughs> Okay, so let's see a little bit of practice for the weather, okay? And here you're going to see some pictures. Van a ver algunas imágenes and you have to tell me what's the weather or the season, okay? So for example here, what's the weather like? Today, uh, cloudy. It's cloudy. Windy. Oh, no. Windy. It's, yes, but good try, windy. good try. It's windy, yes. Let's go, next one. Okay, so I am where, but okay, bye, usted me va a ir a leer. Let's see, Dennis, help me to read here. Uh, it is snowing. Okay, but can you read the sentence? ¿Podrías leer la oración? Uh, sorry, uh, I am wearing a hat and a scarf. It is snowing. Okay, it's a snowing. Okay, it's a snowing. Oh no! It's cold. Don't worry, don't worry. Let's try with this one. Let's go with uh, Walter. Can you read this one, Walter? Hey. <laughs> don't worry, I don't worry. I'm wearing my right coat and Willis is uh, raining. Okay. Excellent, thank you, Mister. Let's go. <laughs> Next one, uh, Jonathan. Nah. <laughs> it's super it's easy. Cold. Uh huh. It's cold. I'm wearing a hat and a scarf. Okay. Very good, Dennis. Let's go with the next one. Um. Ahí eh, sería I vamos a pronunciar I be I, I got, be got I, no I got I got a kite, kite. Mm -hmm. is a uh, cloudy mm. oh, no no yeah. sorry 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 <laughs> Uh, windy, it's windy. Yes, awesome, very good. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Maria Salome, let's go, Miss. It's sunny and wearing a uh, sun hat. 
excellent, Maria Salome. Let's go with next one. Daniela, can you help me with this one? Daniela? Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, what's your favorite season? Uh -huh. it, it's summer. summer. Excellent. Thank you, Miss. Very good. Let's get with next one. Uh, Marvin. Marvin, are you there? Stop por ahí, Marvin. Okay. Read it, please. What's your favorite season? It's winter. Okay. Excellent. Thank you, Joel. Let's go, Joel. What's your favorite? This season. This season. season. Uh huh. Yes, winter. Okay. Oh no! But what? Here it is. It's the image, Mister. It's it's spring. Okay. Mm -hmm. O sea, es eh, primavera. Okay. When todo florece, so pretty and yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. And when todo está flore, eh, pues con Así va, con colores y es muy bonito, ok. For me, I don't know, for me, a algunas personas no les gusta, pero a otras les gusta solo rainy, winter, but that's ok, no hay problema. We, we have everything. Let's go with Noé, Noé. Help me with the last one, ayúdame con la última, Noé. Uy, what is happening? Wait, Noé. Ay, ay, what is happening? Give me one second, Noé. No more. No, yes, we do have one more. I don't know what is happening. It doesn't want to go. What is happening? I don't know what happened. Wait, wait, wait. Let's go and take it off. And then, I don't know. Let's charge it again. You're going to help me with the first one. Okay, so Noe, I don't know if it's the same, but tell me what's the correct answer for this one, please, Mr. Noe. Okay. It was the weather like. Uh huh. It's, it's windy. Yay! Very good. Okay. Now, the other ones we already repeat, right? Los otros ya los habíamos repetido, so we are good with that. Thank you, Mister, for helping me. Thank you, everybody, for helping me so far. Okay. Now, we are going to continue, okay, with this next topic. I know it's not in the in the practice, in the platform, but I feel it's very important. I don't know if you know, este, le voy a, voy a presentarles otro tema que este, no está en la plataforma, de hecho, en, tal vez no está en la práctica, pero I feel, pero yo siento que es algo, un tema muy importante que practicar. This topic is simple present, ok, este es el simple present. Maybe you know this, yo no sé si ustedes ya han escuchado acerca del simple present, alguien ha escuchado, tell me what do you know, qué es lo que saben acerca del simple present. Somebody? Nobody? I read. Uh huh. What? I, what? Uh I huh. I read. Uh huh. Yes, Jonathan. I read. Uh huh. Jonathan, yes, I hear. Uh, son, uh -huh. son cosas que, que, o sea, que actualmente son de esa manera. Decir, okay. No necesariamente que están pasando en este momento, sino que, que cosas que, yeah. que, que son de esa forma. Exactly, Mr. Thank you very much. Yes. So, basically, uh, bueno, William, tú, tú ibas a decir algo. Tell me, William. Casi lo mismo son las acciones que se realizan en el tiempo presente. Exactly. So, son acciones que están sucediendo ahorita mismo. But also, pero también eh, las utilizamos para hablar acerca de todo lo que realizamos todos los días. O sea, algo rutinario, un hábito. Por ejemplo, one habit that we have is to brush our teeth, right? Algo que hacemos todos los días es que nos lavamos los dientes. Es un hábito que tenemos. But then, pero también tenemos la rutina, la rutina de que vamos a trabajar, que manejamos, que nos subimos al bus, right? We ride the, ride the car, maybe we work, we study, 
we listen to music and many more things. Right now, we are going to review that. Vamos a repasar un poco acerca de eso. Okay, so let's go with, give me one second because I don't know what happened. Okay, here. So we are going with habits. This is the first one, okay? Can you help me to read the first slide, please? Guillermo, me ayudas acá, please, Guillermo? We use the present simple to talk about things we do all of the time. Mm -hmm. I get the service bus at seven at time every morning. Mm -hmm. Ali brushes his kids before he goes to bed. Excellent. Okay, so here we have two habits that this person have. Aquí tenemos dos acciones que son hábitos. La primera es que dice que toma como hábito todos los días a las 7 de la mañana el bus. Number two, brushes the teeth. Okay, después brush, 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 brush. And then we have next one, the next use. Ismael, help me to read, please, Ismael. Okay, teacher. Okay, thank you. Eh, de donde dice things that. Yeah, things true. that, yeah. Okay. <laughs> things that are always true. Mm -hmm. We use the present simple to talk about things that are always true. Uh -huh. The sky is blue. Mm -hmm. The air goes around the sun. Uh -huh. I am a student. Mm -hmm. Self is on the Asian side of Istanbul. Yeah. Tigers are big cats. Excellent. Thank you very much, Mr. Thank you. Okay, so también utilizamos el simple present para hablar de, sobre cosas que son verdaderas, okay? And uh, here we have them. The sky is blue, right? El, el, también el verbo to be, pues es... Eh, considerado presente. I am a student, tigers, I be cat, y así muchas cosas más. Now, eh, how do we create these sentences? ¿Cómo creamos las, las oraciones? Give me one second so I can put my, my whiteboard. Un segundo, solo quiero poner mi whiteboard. So, basically, so básicamente, simple present, para decir una rutina que ustedes hagan, remember, simple present, for routines, ¿y qué más dijimos que era? ¿Para qué más? Habits. Habits, ajá. Uh -huh. And things that are true, y cosas que son verdad, ¿verdad? And so, for example, here, um, we can say, la, los normales, pues, lo utilizamos. ¿Cuáles son los sujetos que tenemos? I, you, we, and they. Estos son los más fáciles, ¿verdad? Ajá. Y de ahí decimos algo que realizamos todos los días. Like, for example, I, hmm, I take the bus. And we don't change nothing. Can you tell me another activity that you do every day? ¿Me podrían hablar sobre algo que hacen todos los días? That you can use this one? ¿Un hábito o rutina? Take a shower every day. Ah, okay. I take a shower every day. Yes, mister. I, uh -huh. I wake up at 7 a.m. Okay, very good. At 7 a.m., very good. Anything else? Somebody else? That wants to share another idea? I wear in a watch. Ah, I wear a watch. Very good, mister. I wear a watch. Very good. Anybody else? Maria Salome, can you tell me one activity that you do every day? I mm -hmm. drink the coffee. Ah, I drink coffee. Excellent. Very good, Miss. Thank you. Okay, so that's for the affirmative, right? Eso es para, solo para I, you, we, and they, ¿verdad? Podemos utilizar eso. Pero cuando estamos hablando de otra persona, like he, she, and it, cambia un poquito. Y ahí es donde agregamos lo de la S, lo de la ES, IES, y también lo de la IES. Y aquí we have the different rules, y aquí tenemos las diferentes reglas. Miren, la principal y la más general es esta. Art, at the S, agregar la S. Help me to read this one, please, Miss Mayra. ¿Me podrías ayudar a leer, Miss Mayra? 
Yes, a general rule. Bear plus S. Yeah. Run, runs. Read, reads. Smile, smiles. Write, writes. Excellent. Thank you. Very good, very good. Okay, so solo básicamente le agregamos la S. Like, for example, if I want to say, espérame, si quiero decir, esta, recuerden que es para tercera persona de she, he, y eat. Entonces, por ejemplo, yo quiero decir, ella cocina, sería she, ¿cómo se dice cocina? Cooks. Exactly, cooks, y le agregamos la S. Ella o él corta. Él corta. He cuts. He cuts. cuts. exactly. Or maybe, oh, I'm sorry, he. What about el perro? Oh my goodness, wait a second. Salta. I don't know. The duck? <laughs> yeah. Jump. 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 Exactly, right? Just examples. I'm just thinking about them. Okay. Then, uh, that's the first one. Esta es la primera. Okay, let's go with the next one. Next rule. Uh, give me one second. Okay, so can you help me to read, please, William? Verbs ending I N Y. Mm -hmm. Vowel match Y. R mm -hmm. is. Yeah. Consonant match Y. Mm -hmm. Change the Y. Mm -hmm. I N R E S. Mm -hmm. Play, play. Pay, pay. Mm -hmm. Study, studies. Cry, cry. Exactly, thank you, Mr. Cuando tenemos una vocal antes de una Y, ok, simplemente le vamos a agregar una S. Pero si tenemos eh, otro, otro tipo de, like structures, ok, like for example with Y en la consonant, si tenemos la Y y después una consonante, vamos a cambiar esa Y por una IES, ok, y ahí tenemos study, studies, cry, cries. What about a stay? ¿Cómo sería stay? La tercera persona, o sea, para utilizarlo de ella, él o eso. ¿Cómo sería? Stays. Stays. ¿Por qué? Porque miren, tiene acá una consonante, una vocal y una consonante. ¿Ok? What about if we have fly? ¿Y si tenemos fly, cómo sería? Flies. Exactly. Fly. Cambia, vea, flies. Entonces le agregamos IES. Perfect, very good. Entonces, if we want to say, si te queremos decir, I'm sorry. Uh, el, oh my goodness. What animal flies? I'm thinking, ah, uh, <laughs> I don't know. El what? Butterflies. Ah, okay, the butterfly, la mariposa, vuela, it will be flies, right? But what about, what about if we want to say, eh, él juega football, soccer, let's say, okay? So sería, he, he plays, uh, he plays soccer. soccer. He Excellent. Entonces aquí solo le damos la S. ¿verdad? En el caso del fly, porque con Y, vea, que termina regularmente en tercera persona changes. Yes, Walter. Esto cerro sería para la tercera persona, ¿verdad? Yes, esto solo es para okay. third okay. person, para he, she, and it. That is okay. third Gracias. person. No problem. Yeah, very good. Okay. And then, for example, you want to say me, uh, uh, let's say, wait, I think I have one more rule. Creo que hay una regla más, I don't remember. Yeah, this one. That is the one with the these letters. Can you help me to read, please, these letters? Oh, there we have. Um, let's go with hmm. Andrea. Help me, please. Verb ending. Mm -hmm. I am. I'm sorry. ¿Cuál, cuál, cuál es? No sé si. Casi no veo. No veo. Ajá. 
Wait, wait a second then. Give me one second. Dame un segundo. I, I think it's the green things. Creo que es las cositas verdes que no se ven porque ni me neither means. Don't worry. I'm blind too. Don't worry. <laughs> Give me one second. Okay, now, yeah, you will see them. Okay, now, yeah, you will see. Okay, there, Miss. Let's go. One, two, three, Miss Andrea. Okay. Birds and the I am. O is, 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 H, mm -hmm. C, H, X, mm -hmm. C, and mm -hmm. E, S, mm -hmm. go, mm -hmm. go, mm -hmm. watch, mm -hmm. watch, mm -hmm. kiss, Kisses, mm -hmm. relax, relaxes, mm -hmm. wash, washes, mm -hmm. spritz, spritzes. Exactly, thank you, Miss. Very good. So, cuando queramos hablar de otra persona, ma'am, so basically what we do is that, oh, what is happening here? Mm. Okay, there you have it. Okay, so basically, if you want to say, for example, my mother, my mother, eh, mi mamá ve televisión, sería my mother watches, watches TV, right? Or maybe mm -hmm. mi, pa mi papá arregla el carro, sería my father fixes the car. Okay, fixes the car. Very good. What, ¿Por qué? Porque termina fix, vea que es arreglar, pero como estamos hablando de my father, sería fixes, right? What about if we say, uy, my father, me faltó ahí, father. Or what about if we say, ella eh, lava los platos? She would... watches the dish. Exactly. She watches the dish. ¿Por qué? Porque watch sería lo normal, ¿verdad? pero como estamos hablando en tercera persona de she, entonces le agregamos es, sería watches, right? Then I have some more examples, okay, that you are going to read them, okay? Oh, no, I have this list that you are going to conjugate. Okay, aquí tengo esta lista, la, uy, la cual van a ustedes agregarles, van a elegir cinco de ellos y le van a agregar lo que se tenga que agregar depende del verbo que ustedes elijan. Van a elegir three verbs. Only three verbs because it's almost finished. Three verbs. Van a elegir tres de estos verbos y los van a, a convertir a tercera persona porque están en primera y en segunda. ¿verdad? Van a convertir la tercera. Por ejemplo, walk sería walks. Enjoy sería. Enjoy. Exactly. Eh, y de ahí sí, veas, continuando. Ok, but for this one, ok, let's see. Voy a preguntarle uno a cada uno y ustedes me van ayudando para ver cómo nos queda. Let's start with Dennis. Dennis, fly, ¿cómo sería? Pues sería eh, flyers. Exactly, mister, thank you. ¿Y push? Pushes. Exactly, thank you. It teach? Teachers. Excellent. Okay, let's go next one. Antonio, skip. Esquises. Hmm, ¿por qué esquises? Uh, Termina con no... P. Termina con P. Uh, este verbo. ¿Qué significa saltarse? Saltarse esquise. algo. Okay. Skip, solo se le agrega yeah, S, Ajá, porque no, no entra en ninguna regla, no tiene okay. Y, no tiene X, no tiene O, no tiene Z, este, no tiene CH, oh, no. solo sería oh, no, Ajá, solo la S. Uh -huh. okay. Very good, let's see next one, Daniela, pull. Ay, Antonio, me faltaron verbos, se me olvidaron. Ah. Pull, pull, mister, tell me. Pulls. Ajá, ¿sí? Pulls. Ajá, ¿y el siguiente? ¿Sí? Um, 
Exactly, thank you. Oh, now yes, Miss Daniela, come. Um, mm -hmm. Enter. Enter. Exactly. Uh, run. Run. Exactly. Guillermo, get up. Get up. Ajá, vaya. En este caso, el verbo lo vamos a agregar en el, el verbo. La S lo vamos a agregar en el primer verbo, porque lo siguiente es una preposición. Entonces sería get up. Ok, mister. Guillermo, fix. Fixes. Exactly, thank you. Talk. Talks. Excellent, thank you. Let's go next one. Ismael, repeat. Repeat. Exactly. Cook. Cookies. Uh, no, it's cooks. Thank you, uh, Thank you, Mister. Very good. Joel, say. Sites. Exactly. Where? Where's? Exactly, solo agregamos ese, ¿verdad? Let's go, María Salomé, crush. Crushes. Uh -huh. Jump. Jumps. Exactly. Do. Let's go, Jonathan. Does. Uh -huh. Eat break. Break. Exactly. So these are some verbs, some more verbs, if you need them. Aquí están un poquito eh, de... The ejemplos, the examples that you can use them, que los pueden utilizar para future sentences. Then I have, y después tengo acá algunos ejemplos that you're going to help me to read. Todavía me van a ayudar a leer. Marvin, help me here, please, mister. Lee lo de arriba y después con like S. Yes. Wake up. Uh -huh. Wake up. Exactly, thank you. Let's go, Mayra. Brush his teeth. Mm -hmm. ¿Cómo sería en third person? He brushes his teeth. Excellent, thank you. Oh, Bart brushes his ah, teeth. Brad brushes no, his teeth. Yes. But don't worry, miss. He, he is a he, right? Okay. <laughs> yeah, but that was perfect. Noé. Breakfast. Mm -hmm. In the third person? Uh, he? He eats brave. Yes, brave. excellent, very good. Solo sería agregarle la S y, y bueno, en este caso era bar, pero puedes decir he, porque sí, it's a boy, right? So yeah. Very good, thank you, Walter. Very good. Go to a school. Mm -hmm. And he goes to a school. Excellent. Thank you. Let's go, William. Skate. Bart skates. Exactly. <laughs> Excellent. Thank you. Let's go, next one. Uh, Andrea. Miss Andrea. Lunch. I can't really answer. <laughs> Oh my goodness. Okay, read it. That's okay. But I had lunch. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Thank you. Let's go, Antonio. Watch TV. Mm -hmm. She is. They. Uh, they. 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 Uh -huh. She. Uh -huh. is... No, pero que si no, decís no. he, she, she, she o el they. ¿Cuál de los tres vas a elegir? No. She. 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 Okay, she, solo she. 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 She did. Por qué she? Uh, no, no. She. Mm -hmm. um, I don't know. I don't know. ¿Cómo se? Como, mirar televisión, vea. Watch yeah. TV. Como termina ese H. Sería she, she watch. Okay. Vas a agregarle but, but S. Watch TV. Yes. Watches. Okay. Watches, watches TV. Watches, watches Very TV. good. Thank you. 
Noé, do you want to do another one, Noé? ¿Quieres hacer otra, Noé? Please. Okay. Wake up. Ajá. Ajá. And? Uh, she wakes uh -huh. up. up. It wakes up. Exactly. Uh -huh. Thank you. Very good. Dennis, this one. Yeah, uh, she she do exercise. Ah, pero termina en o, entonces le vas a agregar es. Entonces sería she she exercise does does exercise porque tiene el do. Uh, sorry, es, en exercise estaba hasta agregando. No, eh, ah, no, 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 pero es que el primer verbo sería acá. Ajá. Sí, tú. Sí, Tengan en cuenta eso porque van a haber muchas acciones que llevan así una palabra al inicio y después otra, ¿verdad? así como do exercise y como es como dos acciones, ¿verdad? pero Ajá. siempre, siempre le vamos a agregar la es cuando sea tercera persona a la primera. Uh -huh. Ah, ok, ok. Uh -huh. Just to remind, right? So, solo para recordar. Okay. ok, let's go with the next one. Guillermo, this one. Get dresses. Ajá, uh -huh. and? She gets dressed. Excellent. Thank you. Okay. Very good. So we are going to stay here so far. Aquí nos vamos a quedar. Okay. We are going to continue tomorrow. Vamos a continuar el día de mañana. Thank you, everybody, for coming today. Okay. To today's class. Gracias a todos por venir el día de ahora. I really appreciate that. De verdad, aprecio eso. And I hope to see you tomorrow. Okay. Have a great night. Bye-bye, everybody. Take care. Bye. 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 Good night. Bye. Good night, everybody. Bye. Take care. Bye bye. Take care. Bye. Bye. Bye bye. Have a great night. Bye. Good night, teacher. Good night, mister. Bye. 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 Bye.